This video is of some of our day hikes that we took here in Silverton. We took a couple of them, sort of practice to get in shape for doing Wham Ridge. The first one we did was Vermilion Peak via Ice Lake. That's Ice Lake in the picture here. On the way up to Ice Lake, we ran across just acres and acres of beautiful wildflowers. Couldn't believe how many there were around. This is the sun shining through corn plants and larkspurs. We had to cross a creek at one point, and so after we got across, you know, it was change the socks and get the feet dry. Continued on up to Ice Lake, which gets some uh, snow melt with glacial till in it, which turns it that beautiful blue color. This is a nice little lake where some mountains were reflecting into it. And there's a little bit of snow back in there. Just a beautiful day. These are primroses. They like to grow near um, the creeks and in moist conditions. I thought they were just real pretty. And this is a primrose near a lake. And that lake's reflecting the mountain we did, which is the one in the middle towards the back. It's called Vermilion Peak. On the way up, we ran across an old miner's shack that had collapsed. There's an awful lot of mining in the area. Perhaps this was Peter Spite, fall of 1928, who inadvertently found peace in the most beautiful place on earth. We thought it was awful beautiful. This is continuing on, on up to Vermilion Peak. We had to go across some snow fields. No problem. They were nice and gentle. This is looking back towards Ice Lake. And then this is looking up Vermilion Peak. We had to walk along the ridge line there to get to the summit. All rocks, um, but it wasn't too bad. Some of it was a little bit loose. And um, at one point, the exposure got pretty bad. Archie and I both ended up kind of holding on to the rock to get across. It was about a thousand feet down either side of this little crossing. Kind of scary, and the wind was blowing a little bit. But we got on top, and it was pretty happy. To, we were pretty happy to be there. This is a panorama from the summit. We were sitting there eating lunch, and I took this panorama. That's Ice Lake down there. On the way down, just couldn't stop it. Couldn't stop taking pictures of Ice Lake and another little lake. Those are wild onions in the foreground. And this is the last picture of Ice Lake. And nope, I didn't even touch up that color. Isn't it just a pretty turquoise? The next one we did was the Grand Turk Mountain. This one, um, most of the way, we there was no path. So we were just kind of following the terrain. We checked it out pretty careful, figured out which way we wanted to go. Again, there were a lot of flowers, the corn plants and the larkspurs. And some of those uh, white ones are called cow parsley. This is looking back down the valley that we had just come through. In some places, there was a trail. This is crossing along a big scree slope over to the Grand Turk, which is that mountain off in the distance there. It's the third bump to the right. Along the way, the flowers again were just beautiful. And that uh, rock slope you see in the background there, that's the one where I was just crossing in the picture before. Then there's the little town of Silverton down there. When we got up to the top of the Grand Turk, you could look right down into Silverton. And then this is a video, a panorama. I basically just did a circle right on the top of the mountain to look across at all the different um, mountains in the area. That's called the Sultan over there. We were going to do that, but the weather was starting to look bad, so we decided just to head back at this point. And there's uh, Silverton again down there. They run a lot of ski trips from Silverton up into this basin in the wintertime. They uh, helicopter people up. That'd be pretty cool. And then there's uh, Kendall Mountain just above Silverton to the right. That's uh, the one we climbed about the second day we were in town. And then off in the distance here, we're going to be looking up into what's called the Wiminuchi Wilderness, which is where Wham Ridge is. Um, that series of mountain there, mountains there is called the Grenadiers. And 
when you see the movie of our trip up into Wham Ridge, you're going to be up in the Grenadiers. That road there you see in the distance, that goes to Durango, which is where we have to go to get groceries, pretty much, if we want to get anything uh, much. And then that's looking back across the slope we came on. This is a beautiful uh, batch of columbine with the grenadiers in the background. And last but not least, we found some of the most beautiful mushrooms. I just have to think they're very, very poisonous. At any rate, that's a couple of our trips, day hikes, here in the San Juans.